What's up Guardians, it's your boy Doodle from Doodles of Destiny, and today I want to share a quick loadout you can use in the Bunker E15 Legend Lost Sector. But before I get into it, don't forget to hit that subscribe button to receive Destiny 2 news, tricks and tips, and all sorts of Destiny 2 content. Now in Season 15 being Season of the Lost, I would highly recommend taking advantage of the Fusion Rifle meta. Pairing any Fusion Rifle with the Armor Mod Particle Deconstruction will give you a huge advantage in any high content activity. This week's modifiers are Shocker, where Radalorian Fluid spawns upon defeating Vex enemies, Void Burn, which increases the output damage of Void weapons and abilities for you and your enemies by 50%, and Void Shields, which can only be broken with Void weapons and abilities or an anti-barrier weapon. The rewards dropping today are the Exotic Chest Armor, being Ominoculus for the Hunters, Curious of a Falling Star for the Titans, and the Mantle of Battle Harmony for the Warlock. There is also a chance of receiving other exotics from the loot pool, enhancement cores, and enhancement prisms. As far as weapons go, I use the Braytech Werewolf Auto Rifle with Anti-Barrier Mod, the Trinity Ghoul Combat Bow with Overload Bow, and the Threaded Needle Linear Fusion Rifle paired with Particle Deconstruction. As I mentioned before in this Lost Sector, you will be facing enemies with Void Shields, specifically Vex Menatars. You will also be facing Vex Overload Champions and Barrier Champions. So make sure you have the right weapons and your mods on to break their shields before you start, as your weapons and gear will be locked once you enter. Trinity Ghoul is more or less used for stunning the frequent overload champions which spawn in the first room and in the last room. It can also be a great ad clearing tool if you're trying to keep your distance, which is a plus in high content activities. Braytech Werewolf will generally be used for popping off barrier shields and shooting through all shielded enemies. As anti-barrier mod means you can shoot through anything, I would definitely take this into consideration. There is only one barrier champion in the Lost Sector, so any auto rifle in my opinion would work just as fine for this. Threaded Needle is used for champion DPS and when paired with the mod Particle Deconstruction does absolute work on all champions. Combine all three of these weapons and you may find this Lost Sector a lot easier. Like, way easier. Anyways Guardians, that's all the time I have to focus on this specific Lost Sector. If you find this setup useful or know of any that would make farming this easier, hit the like button and leave a comment down below. And as always, this is Doodle, from Doodles of Destiny.